Okay, you know what? I just couldn't, like... I had to, like, there's something else I gotta do. Like, I... There's gotta be a better ending. So I'm gonna come back and see if I can redo this last chapter. I don't imagine there's more things throughout most of the game I would need to do. Because, like, it gave me the knife. Let's skip through all this. Okay, can I find the bobby pin right now? Okay, I can get the bobby pin. Still need the shovel for that. Where'd she go? The big crybaby. Um... All right, we need the screwdriver. So let's grab the screwdriver. Can I use the bobby pin yet? No, not yet. I'm still mad at her. I'll come back in a little while. Okay. All right, so I got to talk to the noodle lady. Me, I thought I'd drop by just to see what you did. We made it back. So, where's your sister? Zombie, probably crying in a room. So, the right, call me dumb. Blah, blah, blah. Skip through all that. Okay. Picture on here. Okay. I still gotta come back to that. I can hear something. It sounds like. Someone's calling my name. Should I call back? Wait. It's a mirror. What the fuck? What's this? Do I gotta... See, L U Z. I was thinking maybe I'd have to write my name. S O M B R I. I don't think it'd be zombie. Um. This has to be like this has got to change the ending, right? I I don't know why or what, but I didn't do this before. What name would it be? break or strengthen we're home it's finally over or is it the truth lies in the reflection of my name oh what was that other sister's name um or was it the the witch or i don't remember uh what was her name um Ashina, Ashina, A S H I. -A. Yeah, that's got to be it. Uh, A S H I N A. Oh, oh, you called my name. It seems my mother was wrong. You are the smart one, not Luzia. Now that we're finally meeting, would you like to see something? I can show you the true ending to this story. Yo, okay, are you ready? Then kill my mother and save Sombria. What the fuck? Kill your mother. Is that the, the noodle lady? That's what the knife is for. Okay, okay, I know what I gotta do. Um, So I gotta come down here. Gotta talk to my mom. Luzia, blah, blah. Yeah, because I didn't use a knife before. I was wondering what it was for. It must be to kill the noodle lady. 
Dude, I felt like she was manipulating me, like, especially there near the end, like, because everyone knew her. She's been telling everyone these stories. Come on, come on, hurry. Let's get all through this. Oh, man, that's still so sad. Sorry, mom. Let's uh grab the shovel. Okay. Sorry, I looked at this, but I'm gonna look again. Okay. See, it's this part. Like she was like urging me to go up there and kill Luzia. I mean, I know the mom said I needed to do it, right? But the noodle lady seemed like she was like real real questioning about it. Let's come out here and get the knife. It's the butcher's knife. All right. All right, let's kill this fucking bitch. Hey, can I ask you something? Who, me? Yes, you. You can ask me anything, my dear. Okay. Truth or dare? <gasps> what? This isn't the time to be playing game. Truth or dare? Fine. Truth. Who are you? I've told you before. I am Yokana Kakam... You're lying again. Luzia, you shouldn't be putting your nose into... You seemed so eager to play this game with me before. So play it with me now. Who are you? I'm... Luzia. Sombria's conscience. I'm an older envision of you. But a far better one. Truth or dare? Wait, don't I get a turn? Haven't you had enough turns at this game? Truth or dare? Truth! Why am I so different now? <sighs> Haven't you noticed anything lately? Now that your mother is gone, your personality will change back to its stupid old self. Your pathetic mother's spirit was infused with yours. Until she died, ha! <laughs> she failed to break the loop. Now you will follow in her footsteps. Truth or dare? Enough of this pathetic game. Your time is up, Luzia. Truth or dare? Dare! What are you gonna do about that? I dare. I dare you. What? What do you dare me to do? I dare you to listen to my little secret. A secret? <laughs> is that all? Okay, Luzia. What's your secret? Thank you. <gasps> For telling me the truth. Finally. Oh, fucking A. She just like... Ah, okay. So she... Okay. Please tell me Sombria is still alive. Please, please, please. Sombria, please still be alive. Hey, Zombie. I just wanted to check on you. Please be... <gasps> yes! Yes! Zombie? She's... She's gone. She told you, didn't she? She told you everything. She did. So what are you going to do now? I have to do what is right. Then do it. Okay. Huh? Where are you going? I'm going to bed. It's late. What do you mean it's late? Why won't you kill? Because I don't have to. I may be 12, but I can tell when a story is done. I'll see you in the morning. But how? Sombria. Huh? She doesn't know, does she? No. What the? What? She doesn't know? 
How many times has she been in this godforsaken loop? She needs to wake up. You know she won't. She needs to die. Wait, is that what you saw in the tunnel, Sombria? You know you cannot save her. I can try. She saved me, remember? Besides, she's my sister. What the fuck? That's why Mr. Gustav had a jerky problem. Mom said she would be here soon. I don't see what's taking her so long. She works here. Who am I kidding? You can't hear me anyway. Excuse me, dearie. Huh? Can you please keep it down? I'm waiting for my daughters to arrive, and I can't hear them. I'm sorry. I'll keep my voice down for you. Thank you. Oh, I'm playing a somber now. But I thought she died. So she has some sort of consciousness, right? Because that's how she imagined the noodle lady. And then her daughters were part of the story too. Inventory. Dude. Oh, man. Oh, this is everyone. Hey, Psalms, how's it going? Not so good. Still worried about Luzia, eh? She's a tough kid. She'll be alright. I hope so. Still seeing the psychologist? Got no choice. Either this or jail. What did you do to win that deal? Tried to rob a gas station with a butcher's knife and a mask. But I couldn't do it in the end. Why not? I scared the kid standing, standing next to me. I just couldn't do it after I saw her cry. So I gave her a candy bar and waited for the cops. At least she did the right thing. Yeah, I guess. Are you seeing him today? Nah, I don't really want to see him anymore. I don't blame you. The guy's a creep. Anyway, I'll probably be ready to go in soon. Well, good luck in there. Thanks. I'll catch you later, Psalms. That's a cute doll you have there. Hey, thanks. Her name is Molly. Huh? I know, Bird. Now, don't you lose her again. I won't, Sombria. Please call me Zombie. Luzia always does. How is Luzia? She, she's been here for a long time now. She's doing really well. I hope. I'm sure she'll wake up soon. Then she can play with me and Molly. Want to play tea party? Sorry, Bird. I've got stuff to do. Okay. So all these people in here were the ones that... So, oh my god, there's a lot of them. All of these people were in the dream. Whoa, what the fuck is that thing? Why would that be in a hospital? Oh, this is everyone. Uh, I know I keep saying that, but wow. Wow. Hey, can I ask you something? Uh, sure. Who does your hair? It's so cute. Uh, thanks. My mom does it for me. It's a traditional look, apparently. <laughs> she looks more like a big mouse. I don't know why you want to look like her, Ashina. Don't mind her. She's just jealous. More like you're jealous. Yeah, right. The only thing I would be jealous about is that you're taller than me. She has really nice legs, you know. See? Jealous. Yes, I know. <laughs> you both fight about this every day. You girls visiting your mother again? Yes. No. How come your mother is a lot older than you two? Well, she's not really our mother. She's our grandmother. Our mother died and she just took over. You can thank her for that. She died giving birth to her. I'm sorry to hear that. It's fine. We have a new mother now. Yeah, what's left of her, that is. I'll catch up with you two later. Okay, talk to you later. 
I still love your hair. Hey, remember me? Oh, yes. You're Sombro, right? <laughs> Actually, it's Sombria. But that was a pretty good guess. I'm sorry about that. I don't usually come in here. Well, only use the vending machine. The one at the hotel is... I know, I know. It's broken. You say that every day when, we, when you come in here. I come here every day? Yep, every break you have. I noticed that you never buy anything from the machine. What? What do you mean? I buy snacks from the machine all the time. Okay, okay, mister. I'm not making it obvious. Oh, mister, I'm not making it obvious. Just make sure you don't stare at my butt for too long. <laughs> Was that really that obvious? I'm so sorry. It's fine. I've known for a while now. I feel like an idiot. I should hide in the closet somewhere and never come out. Well, maybe you should. But then you wouldn't be able to see my butt. <laughs> I promise I won't look at it anymore. You can look at it whenever you want. But next time, just talk to me. It's a much better way to break the ice. Okay. Thanks, Sombria. That's an odd way to sort of ask a dude out. <laughs> oh, it's the train guy, right? Ah, Sombria, my darling. How's the little one? She's getting much better. The doctor says she could wake up any time now. That's grand news, young one. I wish all the best for your younger sibling. Thanks, Gustav. How's everything with you? Well, so far, everything is good. I've cut back onto drinking, and I can return to work next week. Well, maybe. That's still good news. I wish the best for you, and hope you can drive those trains again soon. Thank you, young one. You're a very nice girl, and I'm sure your sister will be fine. Thank you. Now time for a little... Oh, no. Oh, I actually made myself yawn. <laughs> Moodle, Moodle. Oh, hey, that's that guy. Dude, so much is explained. Why would this not be like the main ending? Cigarettes. <sighs> Christ, I needed that. It's getting too cramped in there. We need to go home, Luzia. I know you can pull through. I just want us to forget this ever happened. But I can't. It'll haunt me till the day I die. Just please be alright, Luzia. I better see how Luzia is doing. Although, I already know nothing has changed. And maybe it never will. Zombie? <gasps> She's awake. Luzia? Can you please keep it down? Shut up, bitch. I'm trying to listen out for my... Oh, shut up yourself, you old cave bat. Your daughter's already here. They are? Zombie. Yes, Luzia? I'm here. We need to go home. Yes, we do. And now we can. I can't believe you're... We... No, 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 no. Home. No, no. No, no, no. Luzia, don't go, please. <laughs> huh? Psych. <laughs> but how? Well, I've been awake for the last couple of days now. I just unplugged my heart machine cord thingy. Are you fucking serious? Oh my god. Jeez, zombie, take it easy. It's just a prank. A prank? I'll show you. Oh my god. Can you please keep it? If you open your mouth again, I will choke you with your fluid cord. 
Zombie, calm down. I'm... I'm sorry, Luzia. I was really scared. Scared of what? That you wouldn't wake up. Duh, that's what happens after you sleep. You wake up. Luzia, I want to say I'm sorry for everything. I just wanted to show mom I could be responsible. And it seems like I failed both of you. It's not your fault, zombie. It is, Luzia. Because of me, you'll never walk again. It's because I'm lying down, you dummy. I guess they haven't told you yet. Oh, wait. I know what you're talking about. The doctor said I'll be fine. It was just a scratch. Can you believe it? This is too good to be true. Yeah, he thought I was someone else. The nurse gave him the wrong files. Oh, and they gave me cake to say sorry. Why doesn't anybody tell me anything? Hey, pipe down. You upset granny next door. I I'm sorry. I just can't believe... Oh, what the hell's going on? No, my game's glitching out. Why? Oh, what did I miss? Right under my nose. I missed a text dialogue. Hey, can we get some waffles? I've got a bad craving for some waffles. <laughs> okay, sure. I'll see the nurse about your discharge. Oh my god. Every story has a happy ending. Yes, I did. She made it. I love my little sister so much. Thank you, Lucia. It's been a while since we've been here. Where are my damn waffles? Hey, take it easy, tiger. I need waffles. Sorry, sis. But I've been in a coma for like forever. Okay, okay. I see you're back to your normal self again. No, I'm back to my hungry self. Where are these damn waffles? Hey, Luzia. Can I show you something after breakfast? It's sort of my secret place to chill out. It's not a boring place, is it? No way, it's got everything. A swing, a great view, a big old tree. Does it have dinosaurs? Well, no. Then it doesn't have everything. <sighs> well, sis, I've missed you. And I've missed you too, zombie. And your long arms. Huh? Oh, I'm so happy. Yes. So, what do you think? Think of what? This place. It's pretty neat. It has a swing after all. Well, at least you're enjoying yourself. This is my secret place. I usually come here to chill out, but I can't anymore. How come? Because I have to babysit you, silly. But now we can enjoy it together. Hey, zombie. Mm-hmm. Where are all those people? What people? All the people at the hospital. They said goodbye to you when you when we were leaving. Oh, they were just the regulars. I've been visiting you every day. So I got to know them. Huh? The funny thing is though. Mm-hmm. They were all in my dream. But they weren't people. They were ghosts. That's the imagination of a girl who watches too much TV. Hey, at least I have an imagination. Yours would just be about boys and depressing music. <laughs> and I wouldn't change it for the world. Speaking of boys, you still seeing that loser? Jeez, when did you learn all of these fancy words? And no, I caught him making out with another girl in the back of his truck. Doesn't he move furniture in that? He did, until I rang his boss. Kissing in a truck. Ew. That's gross. Luzia? Don't ever change. I won't. But only if we can stay up late. And watch some scary movies. Well, okay. Just don't tell mom. Yes, I'm so happy I went back and played. Ah, oh, that was such a better ending. Man, the other one was so sad. This one was so great. 
I'm sure there's more endings, but I don't care. I got the good ending. That's all I wanted. <laughs> oh man. Let's see if they're gonna say something at the end, like uh, like on the other one. Thank you for playing my big sister. Is that it? Okay. Well, that was a good ending. Like I said, I'm so glad I went back and played it because that was so much better than what I got the first time. That other one was extremely depressing. <laughs> but I guess that's everything. Um, I don't know if there's more endings to this, but um, if there is, I'm, I'm content with what I've got now. So uh, thank you everyone so much for watching. This is going to be the last episode I make of this series. I really hope you all enjoyed it because um, I sure did love this game. But if not, maybe just go play it for yourself. You know, I mean... I mean, if you've already watched it, then I guess you already know everything, but I don't know. I, I enjoyed playing it, although it doesn't seem like most people enjoyed watching it. But anyways, um, I'll go ahead and catch you all in the next video, and I uh, hope you all enjoy, or whatever. I don't know. I still suck at endings. <laughs> Bye.